Hey guys, Kevin Dillon here with Kevin Duffy at halftime at Gillette Stadium as the Patriots take on Tennessee Titans. They're winning 21 to 7, and after an uneven first quarter, the Patriots have really taken over in the second. They scored 21 unanswered points in the second. They could have scored another three if Steven Guskowski did not miss that field goal to end the half. But uh, Kevin, what did we learn in, in the first half here? I think after the first couple of drives, the Patriots figured out how they want to play the Titans on offense. Um, shouldn't have been a surprise because we both knew, we all knew how how bad the Titans were against pass catching running backs, but the Patriots started using Deion Lewis in the passing game. He had, I think, 66 receiving yards in the first half. Danny Amendola also didn't play a ton of the regular season because I think they were saving him for the playoffs. He was a big part of, of the offense right here. I think he has 72 yards uh, at halftime. So the Patriots just got into a kind of a quick rhythm. They went up tempo. The Titans could not match them. It looks like they're physically pretty gassed. On James White's touchdown run to the to the corner of the second, um, the linebackers like barely pursued the play. I just think Tennessee just is way overmatched on defense. Definitely, yeah. I mean, that up-tempo pace they used a couple times really helped the Patriots out. Danny Amendola has been a big part of that. I think he has seven receptions in the first half. Only had more than that twice this entire season. So, uh, I mean, great game so far for him. Great game for Lewis. Obviously, James White with the two touchdowns. Um, and, and Tom Brady's been really good. I mean, uh, almost 200 yards, or maybe he did get to 200 yards. I'm not sure. Yeah. Touchdown passes set them up for that uh, potential field goal at the end. Um, it, was, it was uneven at first. What do you think uh, gave the, the Patriots some trouble there? early on for the Titans? Um, I don't know. They, it just didn't seem like they were going, you know, they were running the ball more. They weren't having success on the ground, and they weren't hitting Amendola Lewis on the short, on short routes over the middle. Um, like on the third and long, he tried to come back to Cooks. That didn't work, and he kind of rushed it. I just think they need to settle into a rhythm. I, the whole line overall has given Brady great protection today. He's hardly been under pressure. Tennessee has elected to really only use their four rushers. They haven't blitzed much at all in this game, and it's not it's not paying off for them. So right now they're just in such a hole. Um, 21-7, they, Tennessee also really hurt themselves with the penalty, uh, the controversial penalty, if you want to call it that, because it was first called a, a false start on Geno Grissom. The ref announces it, then changes it to a neutral zone infraction, gives the Pats an automatic first down, they march down the field, 90 yards later they score a goal of 21-7. So when you're playing the Patriots, little things like that, you just you can't do that if you're the Titans. Yeah, I mean, the penalties have been ridiculous for Tennessee in the first half. I mean, uh, the, the Patriots got three first downs alone on that, that uh, last scoring drive. They got to Chris Hogan. And, uh, I mean, there was flag after flag. They, uh, the Titans ended up getting another false start flag on offense. They had uh, Eric Decker got called for an offensive pass interference. So I don't know the the exact total for Titans penalties, but it's been a big factor in why the Patriots have kind of uh, taken control of this one. Yeah, absolutely. A team like that, you got to come in and play a near perfect game. And I think Tennessee is able to move the ball on them, but the, those penalties and the spots where they were at, like Decker's negated a first down. Um, the, the neutral zone infraction obviously was a huge one. You just you can't do that and beat the Patriots. It just Def doesn't work. Definitely, yeah. Obviously, Patriots' defense has been playing pretty well. Uh, James Harrison, a big part of that against the run. They really kind of shut down Derrick Henry for the most part. He had a weird play at the end there where he tried to run around the edge. It was just a, a weird one. But uh, um, then uh, the Patriots' defense has kind of done pretty well. Yeah. I think the second half is just about starting right now, so we should probably get done right here. But thanks, yeah. everyone, for watching. Uh, we'll ch I'm checked back in for the second half, and uh, we'll see uh, how the Patriots finish. Uh, this video is brought to you by Masters Pirates and Rain Football Team.